Hello folks, welcome to Article Empire. Today, I came with a new video for printing with web services. Web services are online applications that provides us a variety of information that is related to the target organization. You can extract critical information such as domains, subdomains, emails, employee details, contact information, etc. So in this video, uh, we will be exploring how to find the company's domains and subdomains using NatCraft, how to gather personal information using PQ online pupil search service, how to gather information using deep and dark web searching, how to determine target operating system through passive footprinting. So let's get started. So let's see how to find the company's domain and subdomains using NatCraft. So domains and subdomains are part of critical network infrastructure of any organization. This can provide us a organization's history, services and products etc. So let's type as RTPRs www.natcraft.com Under the resources tab, uh, click on site report. So now type the target URL here. Click on the lookup button. Here we can see the site report for pccouncil.org. Um, so you can see the background details here, network details, IP delegation details, hosting history, standard policy framework, BAP trackers, etc. Under the network information, um, click in the domain field, click on this link. So it uh, gives you the subdomains of the target URL. So here we can see the 22 results. We can see the rank of the subdomain site. Um, for seeing NAT blog information, operating system, and the site report. Um, so Aspen, CodeRat, Server, QI, Class, Search, Store, I, Labs, CodeRat Marketing, CISO. So these are the subdomains available for the ecouncil.org website. You can also use um, tools such as a uh, sublist or pantest tools to find the subdomains of any website. Let's move to the second part of the video. Gather information using PQ online pupil search service. Online pupil search service are used by many uh, individuals. So with this, uh, with the help of these services, we can um, identify or like. Um, um, gather information about the address of a particular person, contact details, his state of work, um, uh, his social media profiles, etc. So let's go to the pq.com website. So in the first name, type the name of the person you want to search for. So uh, let's search for Bill Gates. Um, in the location, let's click California and click on the search icon. Here we can see that it has given the 195 matches for Bill Gates from California, United States of America. So it has given the um. 
information sex parts like public records facebook instagram phone book email images etc so these are some uh, like pupils information like name his age and the address take little bit summary about that person mm. Here we can see the public records and the background check of the um person mm. um to view the full report it will direct you to the b verify.com website and that one is the paid website so to view the full detailed report you had to pay for the you had to pay for the um report um some information about the arrest records and driving information is given here um phone book information mm, some uh, information about email addresses but like uh, the full email address we can't say it will redirect to the pin verifier and it's not free Mm, from Facebook profiles, it looks like the fake ones. The Instagram profiles, so this one looks like the legitimate one. Click on the first link. Oh, so here we can see that this is the legitimate profile of um kids. Some TikTok profiles, Twitter profiles, and Pin Interest, Cura, Flickr photo album, MySpace, Wikipedia, some images, FAQ. So, this is how we um, gather information about pupils from with the help of online pupil search services like PQ. Um, you can use some other tools as well, like people, intellect, been verified, etc. So let's move to the third part of the video. Gather information using deep and dark web searches. Deep web consists of web pages and the content that are hidden and cannot be indexed in the traditional web browser, Decor, Firefox, Google Chrome etc it can be accessed by dark web search engines such as tor browser the um dark web is a subset of the deep web where anyone can navigate anonymously without being traced deep web searches can provide critical information such as credit card details passport information id details medical records social media accounts etc so let's launch the Tor browser and click on the connect button. So here we can see that it has been got connected. So let's search for like hacker for hire. And hit enter. Um, let's click on this link. Um, here we can see that this site is for allied hacking services. Um, hacker for hire. Are you having a doubt on your partner or your spouse? Uh, you feel that you are 100% confident that your partner is cheating on you. Do you need evidence but not finding a way? You want to get control over your hacked accounts. Um, so like uh, it uh, has the accounts of the person who pay them. Um, they have listed their benefits like all messages are replied to 
within a few hours hacking jobs are tended to in the order in which it was received uh, we have a team of the best professional hackers who work so effortlessly most of our hackers are having 10 year plus work experience which is an advantage to fulfill your request it takes time to build trust and we are inter- definitely trying to complete the promised work within the given time frame um they have listed the hacking services um snapchat social media hacking expunge criminal records create hacking catch a cheating partner how much does it cost to hire a hacker um trust a hacker for hire service hire a professional hacker online certified trusted data hackers for hire um so this is how you can i guess this is the um, this website is the copied website like this is not the real one i have seen the real website mm. until i click on this so um so this website is a real website okay so they have written here only and uh, well always make sure you are navigating to the real Santa hacker website by checking the address right or uh, hacker.io they are a few clones of our website having similar names and design like the previous one we have seen um friend hacker um are experienced hackers uh, offering many services hacking and social engineering has been our business for 15 plus years we have worked for other people before and now we are also offering our services for everyone with enough cash here um so we can't read the about us information here um why should read this before contacting us our team of experienced hackers are experts at what they do with over 10,000 ongoing clients and thus handle tasks efficiently maintaining a clean and clear job with no cares leaving behind they have listed the technical skills which their <coughs> experienced hackers do have huh? so hacking services which they provide like PC hacking, great sending, cell phone hacking, email hacking, social media hacking, debt clearing, tailored services, record expensing, reputation damage, phone number audit, target audit, or they have some special hacking services listed here um okay so this is how you can gather information from the dark web now let's move to the third part of the video uh that is um determine target operating system through passive footprinting Operating system information is crucial for every ethical hacker. They can acquire details of the operating system running on the target machine by performing um, passive footprinting. So let's see how to do this. So let's go to the census um, base. Um, click on the census search. So here give the target URL. So click on the search button. So 
so here we can see like many results came up so let's click on any one of the result um so under the basic information uh we can see the operating system linux um network as well and many other information like routing protocols labels etc so uh, geographical location we can also see let's go back and click some other like let's click on this hmm. here we can see the operating system running here is ubuntu linux thanks for watching if you like the content of the video so please make sure to subscribe the channel and leave a comment below and don't forget to share this video with your friends who are preparing for certified artificial hacker practical exam until next time stay secure stay curious and keep exploring the fascinating world of cyber security see you soon bye